Hey everyone! So, as you may know, um, I did some Last of Us videos, and my bird's gonna be making noise, so I'm fucking sorry. But, it's a fucking bird, and he's cranky, and uh, he's making me annoyed. But, anyways, um, I've been doing the Last of Us videos, and in some of the titles, there are spoilers. And this is, like, I've done before. Um, but I guess what's different now is they're showing up in suggested videos, like, completely unrelated videos, and they're just showing up. Um, I haven't seen, like, I haven't been browsing YouTube and seeing my videos pop up. Sometimes they do, but the way suggested videos work is if they, they're related to what's in your search history and what's in your browsing history. So, the way I title them, they shouldn't show up if you're just, you know, watching, like, fucking cooking videos or something. You're probably looking at, um, Last of Us stuff. So, the first thing I'd suggest to avoid spoilers, um... Don't go on YouTube gaming section for long time unless, like, until after you play it because people like me upload spoilers. And the only reason I upload spoilers and stuff is because people like to come back and go on YouTube and search it, <clears throat> search it, and then watch it again. That's the only reason I do them. I don't do the videos to spoil people. I don't do, you know, because that's terrible. Like, I feel terrible. Like, I got a few comments, and then, like, for the past couple days, I've just felt like this massive asshole. And, you know, on my channel, I have a bunch of warnings saying, you know, my channel can hit spoilers and everything. But the one thing I have no control over is suggested videos. <clears throat> So, I was trying to find solutions on how to fix that. Like, how how can I um, help people with that? So, what I found was YouTube Options, and it's an extension in Chrome. There's probably a Firefox kind of deal thing, too, but I'm just going to use Chrome. Um, I'll leave a link in the description, of course. So, we're going to add, and then, uh, yeah, agree, I guess. Um... So this is like a kind of like a, a boutique kind of thing for like uh, for YouTube. So you can choose like size and quality. You know you can choose your viewing, your viewing size, whatever. You can even hide ads if you want. But if you'd like to support people, I wouldn't do that. But um, if you just want everything normal except uh, uns uh, no suggested videos, oops, that's not. Just uh, keep it in uh, everything in the do not modify section main thing we want is layout so we're gonna hide the YouTube guide hide a description hide comments not I mean we are going to hide I'm yeah we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna click on hide video suggestions hide playlists uh, we're not gonna worry about that not gonna worry about that um, do not change so now when we go to YouTube We'll go to YouTube right here, make sure my volume's off. Okay, and we'll just click on Drake Denied Access to Heat Locker Room. So, there you go. Um, no suggestions. So, obviously this is not a permanent thing. Until, you know, um, YouTube has an option to let me, you know, completely hide my videos from suggestions, which I would really, really, really like because, you know, um, only about like 10% of my views have been from suggested videos, but they keep going up. Most of my videos are almost all from uh, Google and YouTube searches um, or direct links. Um, but it's getting higher and uh, higher and higher. So either my videos keep getting more featured or something, and with spoiler titer titers titles, I don't want that to happen because uh, like now I'm getting a bunch of comments saying how dare I spoil the game for him and I feel like a giant douche so maybe that'll help people I don't know maybe they'll just be like well way to cover your ass dumbass or whatever so um there you go that's my little stupid video um thanks for watching I guess